what's up guys it's your girl danica and i'm back with another video so guys in this video i will, will be giving you guys some update my little baby right here okay my baby girl is walking now yeah but that's not what i really wanted to talk to you guys about today in this video i want to talk to you guys about breastfeeding how to stop your baby from sucking the breast like guys i was contemplating so much so hard like oh am i going to do this because with my son it was really painful and if my baby does not suck my breast as much my breast would swell and they would start to hurt me and stuff like that but yeah so with my son he sucked my breast up to about two years old yeah in sucking yes him suck it long <laughs> but guys we know that doctor recommend us mother to give our baby breast milk because it's good and it's healthy for the baby we should give them the milk up to about six months or one year one years of age so yeah so i decided to stop my baby from sucking the breast at nine months old oh guys guys it was so stressing i will be putting some clip in this video you can see that i was in pain and stuff like that so guys i'm going to tell you what exactly i used to help me with the pain and the swelling so okay so what i did i heard about using lime lemon put a lime in your breast and it would dry up the milk and i i don't remember seeing any lime on the road when i went to the supermarket or place like that someone told me that it was in my walmart but i don't know if i was looking properly but i didn't get the chance to go there anyways i also heard about cabbage leaf in the breast put the coal cabbage leaf. just take it from the fridge and put it in your your bra on the breast that's what i did and guys i don't know if it's the cabbage that work but i'm telling you it worked it worked i'm gonna be really honest it did work i don't know if it's because it's cold and and the breasts are swollen and you know all of that you know when you put cold things on a swollen area it kind of feel like better yes yeah, so that's what i did and it worked and with the pain what i did was i take some painkiller to help me with the pain okay guys that's it for the breasts so my baby is no longer taking the breasts Woohoo! and it's taking formula it's right here it's right here she was drinking it just now i wanted to catch a video when she was drinking it but babies are so shameful okay so what i do is um i would make her our feed and put it down in our reach and have a bottle of water and i leave them open right so whenever more time i will i will be sitting um more time if i'm on the bed and she's on the floor i'll take her bottle and put it there sometimes i look at my girl and the girl have her bottle they just see the girl take up her bottle and drinking and i yeah and i'm like oh my god look at my baby <laughs> oh my god but guys to be honest i didn't expected that reason being because she was so attached to her breast she was so attached i'm so surprised now she's going to sleep without the breast like she's growing so big look at her right there oh guys i almost forgot it's two weeks now since my baby today monday make 
two weeks, exactly two weeks since my baby stopped sucking the breast. Yeah. She's watching something but yeah the progress is great all thanks to god i feel big up i feel big up god with everything you know but um it was uh, let me tell you how long my breast take to dry up i think it take about four days yeah four days two days and i could still feel the lumps in my breast some thick breast just stiff and like you know until um i continue putting the i continue using the what is the name of it the cabbage leaf just keep on put it as it as me feel like it gets warm because it get warm so quick. Mm. As I feel like it get warm, I put it one next piece. Guys, let me just use what I have. Maybe if I did have the lime, I would use it too. But I have the cabbage, so I use the cabbage leaf and then say it works. So you can do your research. You can ask people and see what best. If you don't want to spend money by anything. Yeah, so me did just use what I have. It work perfectly fine um what else it was four days yeah as i said two days i could still feel the stiffness in my breast my breast was swollen all the way up here around here hold on around here up here like it was huh and i was in pain it was so painful i'm not gonna lie about that like I'm telling you guys, I really make up my mind for it because with my son, I try to stop my son at six months also. Because you know they say up to six months that you want to stop them. As six months come, you want to bum and stop. With my son, when the pain lit me, I said, no, 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 no. I'm going to suck some more. But with she, I have to make up my mind and say, you know what? I can't manage to go through this pain twice. So just make up my mind and do it. Yeah. So guys. Yeah. This is the update. My baby starting to make some noise, and I don't want my video to be noisy. So I'm gonna go. I hope this is helpful to someone. Peace out. See you in my next video. Bye.